Today joining us in studio we have Jim Harrison who is President of the Irish Shows Association and Michael Hughes, the Secretary of the Irish Shows Association. Um, you're very welcome gentlemen. Thank, thank um, you very much. Jim, you're new as President this year in 2014. Tell me a little bit about how you got involved and why you became President. Well first of all, uh, I was Chairman of my own show for five years in Casa Blaney and then I was nominated to um, represent the Mid Midlands region in the Irish Shows. So I was in that for four years now, and then I was vice president last year of the organization. So now it's my turn to be president for the next two years. For two years. Yeah. So you've had a massive involvement over the last number of years. Yes, for four years now I've been on the board of the Irish Shows and uh, very happy to be so and very happy to be the president of this great organization. And Michael, you might tell us a little bit about the Irish Shows Association, uh, when it was founded and, you know, a little bit about the aims and objectives of the organisation. Yeah, well, well, the Irish Shows were originally set up as a regulatory body for agricultural shows throughout the country. And um, in the early years, we used to meet in the RDS uh, one meeting a year. And uh, then in the mid 70s, we were formed into a limited company and our first chairman celebrated his 100th birthday just to about nearly 12 months ago, a fellow by the name of Jack Paul from Neen and County Tipperary. And we're uh, going since uh, we're made up of um, 32 counties. We're a 32 county organisation. I'm very proud of that. Yeah. We have five regions and um, we rotate our AGMs around each region. You know, we're, we're in the Midland region, Jim's home country this year. We were in the Northern region just the year past and uh, we rotate around the Regions. We have about 130 shows affiliated, and um, you know we, we organise various things for them. Championships. Uh, big um, diversion a number of years ago was we were sort of threw into arranging insurance for a lot of shows that couldn't get insurance on their own. Okay. So we put a group packet of insurance together now for about 110 of the 130 shows. Wow. Uh, that. Uh, we arrange that with our insurance brokers and, and uh, that type of thing. And of course, we're very involved with Horseboard Ireland in, mm -hmm. in um, running a series of championships uh, funded by them and uh, some of our shows. And um, we run a lot of other championships right through the showing program from horses, cattle, sheep, dogs, the ladies, and the, not all ladies now, the cook sections and all that. We have competition for everybody. Uh, flowers, gardens and all that, we have, a, we have a, about 75 championships. So there's something for everyone? There's something for everybody, there's something for everybody and, and um, uh, we're very proud of our, our championships and, and uh, happy that they're being supported pretty good, yeah. even in the times we're living in now. You know. Yeah, and uh, Jim, going forward um, into 2014, is there any improvements that you'd like to make or um, any goals that you have? Well, the first goal I would have is a good summer. Yes. Obviously, with the weather situation of 2012, you don't want that repeated. If we could repeat what we, have per, what we had in 2013 weather-wise, mm -hmm. it'd be just brilliant for the shows up and down the country from Donegal to Cork. Yeah. And uh, look, at I'll do my best and get to as many shows as possible throughout the year from Donegal to Cork and looking forward to it very much. You'll have a very busy summer. I will. I will indeed. It'll be probably every weekend. Yeah. I don't know, the wife will not... Maybe speak to me over the phone, but no matter. We'll, we'll, we'll uh, overcome that the <laughs> during the week. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Michael, tell us a little bit more about the Horseboard Ireland um, Irish Shows Association series. Yeah, well, we've been involved with the Horseboard now for a long number of years. And in the last recent past, the um, sponsor a series of championships, you know, they, they, they put up a certain amount of funding to sponsor what we call the Horseboard Island series of championships. You know, we have uh, 12 championships sponsored last year by Horseboard, and that, that have proven to be very, very attractive and very beneficial mm -hmm. to our organisation, to be honest about it, and to the breeders of the animals. As you probably know, the, 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 the um, sponsorship, uh, you know, is not as easy to come by now as it was a number of years ago, like, and shows are struggling, to be honest about it, uh, not just on the sponsorship front, but in, our president there, Jim, referred to the 2012 and a couple of years before that. There were terrible years weather-wise in our shows, yeah. with a lot of them being cancelled and, and uh, some of them being held in terrible conditions. So really the, the, the horse board um, funding is 
And do you find that the championships are an attraction for the shows? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, they are, of course, yeah. They, they, you know, there are not a lot of people go a long way to qualify, first of all. We, um, all our championships that the horse board are funding are bar one. Um, are qualif there's qualifiers held for them at a number of shows. We might have maybe 25 qualifying events with the hope to maybe getting 20 animals in the final. And regularly we do get that type of number. And uh, the sponsorship is really a big factor in, in bringing out the numbers to those championships and uh, we're hoping to continue. We're just hoping that, that uh, with the times it's in it that the government won't see fit to cut back on the... On the so we're hoping they yeah. won't and no, we don't crossed, expect them to do no, it. You know. no. yeah. Well gentlemen, thank you very much for coming in today thank and um, I hope we do have a good summer. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes, indeed. very important for the shows. Very important for the shows up and yeah, down the country yeah. to have a good year. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. And thanks to yourself for the coverage we get for our shows and, and our events, you know, we really yeah. appreciate it, you know. And second that. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much.